Hello friends, today let's see how package reservation is done in Odo 15 inventory. So first, let's open the configuration settings of inventory module and enable the packaging facility. Here already packages are enabled and when you search for packaging, you can see product packaging is already enabled. So after that, here when you open product category, you can see a new field reserve packagings. So this is used to reserve your packagings. So for this, we have two options. First one is reserve only full packaging. So in this case, Odo will not reserve partial packaging. That is, for example, if customer orders two pallets of 1000 units each and you only have 1600 in stock, then only 1000 will be reserved. And if you're setting reserve packaging as partial packaging, then it will allow to reserve partial packaging. That is, if customer orders two pallets of 1000 units each and you only have 1600 in stock, then 1600 will be preserved. So let's check how this works in Odo. So first, I'm going to set reserve packaging as full packaging for the category saleable. Now here, when I open products, you can see a product candle. And I have set the product type as storable. And here you can see I have set the product category for this product candle as all saleable for which I have set the reserve packaging as full packaging. That is reserve only full packaging. Now here under inventory tab, you can find the option to add packaging for this product. So we can create a pallet of 1000. And I have chosen the package type as pallet. And let me change the contain quantity, contain unit as 1000. And you can make this available on purchase and sales. So after adding the packaging, you save the product form. Now here, let's purchase this product candle. So I'm adding quantity as 1,600. Now confirm the order and receive the quantities. So when you check the product, you can see now we only have on hand 1,600. Now let's open our sales module. And if a customer makes an order, That is, he orders two pallets of candles. So here we can set the packaging quantity as two. So two pallets of candle means total 2000 quantity. And here you can see the quantity is automatically updated. Now we can click on confirm to confirm the sale order. And here when you confirm and when you click on this, you can see the availability of the product. So only 1000 units are reserved for the customer. But you can see for product candle, we have 1600 quantities in stock. This is because we have set the reserve packaging as fully reserved. That is order will not reserve partial packaging. So here one pallet 
of candle is reserved for the customer. There is one full package. Now, if you open the product candle and here for the category saleable, I'm going to change the reserve packaging as partial packaging. That is reserve partial packaging. So now, let me open this order and we cancel this one and set this to quotation. Now again, I'm going to add the product candle here. And now if the customer orders two pallets of candle, and if the order is confirmed, here you can see 1,600 units is reserved for the customer because we have 1,600 units in our stock. So as we have said, the reserve packaging as partial packaging, Odo allows us to reserve partial packaging. Now let me create another order, purchase order. So now I'm ordering 200 quantity of candle and let me receive it in my stock. Now when you check the product candle, here you can see your on hand is updated to 1800. And here, let me set this to quotation first. I have to cancel this. And let me delete this product line. Again, if I add the product candle, if the customer orders two pallet of this candle, and if the quotation or sale order is confirmed, here now you can see the reserved is 1,800 because we have 1,800 in stock and the reserve packaging type is partial packaging. So the package is partially reserved. Now let me set this to quotation. So now another customer came and ordered 900 units of candle. So here, you can see 900 units is delivered to the customer. Now when you check the candle, you can see on hand is now 900 units. So we only have 900 units in our stock. Now again, let me open uh, the product category, all saleable, and let me change it to full packaging. And if a customer ordered one pallet of candle, then see this thousand units. And if you confirm the order, here you can see reserve is zero units. We have 9,000, sorry, 900 units in our stock, but we cannot reserve that 900 because the reserve packaging type is fully packaging. And if you want to partially reserve the package, then you have to change the reserve packaging type as 
So this is how reservation for product packaging is done in order 15. And if you want to know more about how product packaging is done in order 15, you can check the link above. So that's all for this video and thanks for watching.